What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to be back to work on this 2004 Honda S2000. As you've seen in the previous video, we did all the framework. We got everything lined up really good. We went ahead and pulled it off the frame. Now we just need to go ahead and clean all this stuff up, get everything painted so it looks like OEM. So the first thing we're going to go ahead and do on this S2000 is probably jack it up in the air, put it on some jack stands so it's easier to work on because we do have some welds we need to clean up under here. And we also need to remove some of this wiring because we are going to be painting this entire engine bay just so we get a nice color match on both sides. So let's go ahead and get that tire off and get everything stripped down. Right, guys we got everything stripped down really nice now we have a good working area right here we took all the wiring off now we can just go ahead and start grinding down all these spot welds right here throw a little bit of seam sealer in there and get this all painted in down and man does it look amazing check that out we don't even need any body filler on that over here it looks awesome too we just need a little bit on this well over here i guess it got contaminated but it's still holding pretty good and we also need to drop a little bit in here we also will be doing a seam seal right here just like it is on the other side so let's go ahead and drop some filler on there and get some primer on it So we got everything sanded really nice. Now we just need to tape it up and throw some primer. So we got everything masked off real nice. Now we're gonna go ahead and spray some etching primer on all of the metal and then we'll hit it with some filler primer after that. So we went ahead and sanded everything up, all the primer and everything looks really good. Put a little seam right there and taped the whole car off. We also have the rebar we're gonna be painting and the fender. We just have to trim it out so we can put it on. So let's go ahead and get this thing all sprayed in. First thing we're gonna do is throw a white ground coat on all the primer because yellow paint doesn't really cover too good. And you always need a ground coat. So let's put the white base coat down and then we'll throw some yellow paint.
Check it out guys, the clear coat turned out absolutely amazing. Now we need to go ahead and untape it off, put the shock back on and the control arm and pull it outside and let it dry really nice and we'll start reassembling all the stuff in the front. So now that all the paint is nice and dry, we're gonna go ahead and start putting all the wiring back together and get the radiators and all the other small little brackets on. So let's go ahead and do that. So we got mostly everything back on the S2000. We are missing a couple things that were broken that we didn't actually see at first. We have some wires over here that are kind of ripped up and I'm pretty sure there's a plug missing over here and another one right there. So we will need to go to the junkyard or I think Goon Squad boys have a parts S2000. So we'll go over there and check it out, see what they have. And we also need this AC line that's broken off right here. It goes all the way in there and we'll be able to button up all this stuff and put the air box on there. But I think that's gonna be a wrap for today's video. All right guys, that's gonna be a wrap for today's video. We got a lot of work done on the S2000. The front end is basically complete. We just need to put the fenders on, get this car painted, and it is done. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, drop a like, and follow me on Instagram at VTune.